Hi, we are here in Castellone Faleto, as you can see the lovely round tower over our shoulder and I have the great honor and privilege of being with Luigi Scavino and Lorenzo Scavino of Azalea. Lorenzo, please take it away. Where, tell us, where are we? So, here we are. This is the Brico Fiasco Vineyard. Castiglione Faletto is right in the center of the Barolo region. You can see the castle, which is very famous. And this is the highest part of Castiglione to 185 meters above sea level. It gets so hot in the summer, you can see the sunlight is shining. Nobody wants to work in this vineyard because of the weather. But uh, it's great to have these vines. Uh, these are 85 year old vines. You can see they are so huge. They produce nothing because they have a very, very few clusters. And the berries are very small, extremely small. So there's more concentration, better ripening. You can see we also have a well here. It's very particular. This was used in the past to collect the rainwater. So when our great-great-grandfathers were using, were spraying copper, they used to collect the rainwater because it was impossible to bring water up here. There's also a pergola tree, which is fantastic. It was used just as a shelter in the, in the summer, in the past, to recover. And uh, also we are, you can see there, La Morra, there's Barolo the other way down there. It's really the center, so we are surrounded by vineyards everywhere. And this is where the origin of the name of this vineyard, this crew, comes fiasco. from this fiasco. Yes, it people... that's why people used to collect this as a fiasco, so as rain to also to drink. To drink water, it was so hot. To drink water. And as also there is the belief which says that as this hill is shaped like a flask, flask. like a bottle with a very narrow top, it was called fiasco and brico because it's the top, the highest part. That's it. And these vines don't give many, many grapes. Yes, very few, very few clusters as you can see. And this is all farmed organic. So you see, we leave the natural grass to grow in between and under the vines, which is periodically cut by hand. Uh, we never spray, so we, we just use copper and sulfur only when strictly necessary. We also, it's very, very important for us to have a great wall of leaves because the leaves are the lungs for a vine. Uh, so we, we cut them quite high, it's close to 2.5 meters, so they have more exposure to the sunlight, much better ripening. And you can also see that we use the sexual confusion so method to control uh, the coupling of the insects. So every 3-4 vines we hang little wires, red wires, which are really really useful not to spray, not to use chemicals. So this is a great way. One of the grand crews of uh, Castellone Felletto in Barolo. Yes, it's a beautiful location. Grazie Luigi, grazie Lorenzo Scavino. Grande piacere. Oh, pleasure. Grazie a te. Grazie, grazie a voi, eh. grazie a voi che, che siete, eh, siete venuti qui a visitare le, le aziende, le vigne. È importantissimo per riuscire a capire bene la nostra filosofia di modo di, di lavorare, la filosofia che abbiamo in ogni azienda. È molto importante questo per riuscire a trasmetterlo ai, ai clienti e al consumatore che è finale cioè in, so in my father was very pleased to have you here in Brico Fiasco and it's, it's a great way to understand the wine so of course if you visit the vineyard you totally understand it thank you and thank you